missions of Glasgow Science Centre and the planetarium here is to inspire the next generation of scientists and families who come here with children, school groups that come to see our school shows. The kids who are coming here today may be the next generation of astronomers or astronauts. In fact, there are astronauts living and working in space all the time and we're only going to continue exploring. the world's very first planetary projector. At nearly 100 years old, it is a marvel of 20th century mechanical engineering. Nowadays, I don't think people would even attempt to build it. In fact, back then, no one wanted to. And it was only after a fair amount of arm twisting by its inventor, Walters Bowersfield, and the director of the Deutsches Museum, Oscar von Miller, which the Zeiss company was eventually convinced to manufacture it are non-scripted. I explain the size of the stars, planets. Sometimes on clear nights you may see something that most people can't see anymore because they live in a city. What we know as the Northern Lights. I put about 4,000 customers through here per year. It's a dream come true and I would have to say now the locals are amazed.